Who on earth ate all the chocolate I just bought? Wasn't it purchased just last night? I haven't even had a bite of it yet. I'm gonna find the culprit. Let's start with the three of us. I'll go first. Last night, my wife and I were watching a movie. We didn't have a chance to eat the chocolate. So, I'm innocent. Pass. I'm also innocent. Last night, I was reading a book in the movie with my dad. Pass. Mewu, it's your turn. Oh no, I was alone last night. How can I prove my innocence? Since you're not speaking up, I guess we'll have to vote against... I got an idea. To find the person who ate the chocolate. Since he's the only person who has eaten the chocolate, there should only be his fingerprints inside the box. Fingerprints? Watch too much TV, huh? They're not that easy to find. Uh -huh. Don't worry. Just apply a drop of 502 glue on the lid, followed by a drop of water next to it. Seal it tightly. What's the point of 502 glue? I learned in school that the main component of 502 glue is cyanoacrylate, which is highly volatile. It can undergo a polymerization reaction with the proteins in human sweat, resulting in the formation of a milky white substance, which will make invisible fingerprints visible. Oh, I can see them! <gasps> Now let's compare and see who actually hates the chocolate. 